Hello everyone. Today we want to um, compare the mean differences of five different samples. And based on these five samples, we want to talk about the actual differences of their population. What I mean, like for Mini, Pooh, Bob, Obi, and Pink Panther, we just have uh, their sample data. We don't have the whole population. But just based on these samples, we want to talk about the differences of their mean populations. One of the way is one-way ANOVA that we talk later. Or instead of one-way ANOVA, we can compare each sample data with each other. Uh, and we use uh, two sample t-test. Uh, with pooled variances. Pooled variances means uh, same variances because uh, if you are, we just compare them uh, two by two and the, all of the combinations is uh, two choose five which means ten different comparison with pooled variances is equal to the one way and a walk. So let's do that. I go to stat, basic statistics, and I pick two sample t tests or two sample t. Then click. First, I choose this option and I said that the data are uh, different columns. For sample one, I choose me mini. Second sample, I choose poo. Then in options. I let uh, the confidence level uh, to be 95% and in the latest one uh, I pick this option assume equal variances or pooled t-test because I want to uh, compare the performance of pooled t-test with one-way ANOVA and as you may know in one-way ANOVA we assume the variance is almost equal. Then I click OK, then OK. Let's go to the p value. p value is almost zero. And as you know, very small p value or p value less than alpha level is means that we reject H null. H null is equality of population means based on the sample data. So, the, uh, the actual population of mean and pro don't have equal means. Let's do uh, same comparison between uh, mini and Bob. Uh, again, I go to stat, basic statistics, and two sample tips. Instead of mini, I choose Bob. And be sure that assume equal variances is still selected. Then I click OK, then OK. Let's look at the p value. We assume that confidence level was 95%. 1 minus confidence interval is 0.05, which is our alpha level. p value is greater than alpha level. So we don't have enough evidence for rejecting the equality of their means. So, the sample mean differences is not that much significant. As you see, for comparisons of their means, we, we can do two by two mean, sample mean comparisons, but it takes a lot of time. Uh, however, in the one way and a wall, you can it's way more easy and you can compare their means all of them in one test so let's in the next video let's look at the one way and a one